welcome everybody to a live stream or you're watching this recorded play of Super Hydra. This is the latest game from Local Multio, and this is their take or his take on elevating the shmup genre. I already put up my review and spotlight earlier today on Game Wisdom and over here on the YouTube channel. But now that I can finally play it for real, I'm going to have some fun tonight. So, briefly, spoiler alert, as I'm going to be trying to go through the entire game. One second, I'm just going to adjust my screen here, so that way I can see comments, while of course playing at the same time. There we go. I'm going to start a new game up here. I already beat the game beforehand, but... This will be my time hopefully going for the true ending, or the legend ending, which means no continuing. But I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to do that here. Delta Lands. Our option force has been detected in the sector. Engage. Okay, ready to rock, Colonel. Unit 37, take off. Again, the music is really good in this one. Hopefully you guys can actually see the screen, too. I want to pick up a shield for safety. Now with that, I want to start filling up my power. And ideally not crash at anything. If I can, I would like to hit level 2 before we get to the boss, but I don't think I'm going to be able to do that. Maybe if I can get lucky. No, not getting that. Oh! Up a special. Uh, this is on the uh, PC, Rob. I believe there's a free version from Local Multio's site, but this is the enhanced version that's now being sold. Boss time. Get through this without getting hit. Not bad. I also want to start filling up my speed boost, which is the blue mark on the bottom left. So here's our map of the world, or the galaxy. In order to beat the game, I just have to get to the end mark all the way at the other end, but to get the good ending, I need to hit everything. So now I can actually equip a subway. Now during my spotlight, I found a bonus life on this level, so I'm going to go for that one for sure. Whoa. One more turbo should fill me up, and then I really don't want to die. Power my bombs. Again, really good music, too. If I blow up any of those buildings, I will get a score penalty. Plus, technically, I'm killing civilians, and we don't want to do that. There's right, one. Alright. We're all maxed out for that one. Now, all I need to do is start collecting specials. I have a good old mini boss. I can exploit that with bombs. Oh no, I saw him bounce up. Now that was in the final boss of this level. Now we have this little lowly section to do. Oh, 
one more should upgrade my bomb support. There we go. And every weapon will need to be powered up if I want to fully make use of it. If I remember, I think the extra life was on the southern path. Careful here. The shield grants me one extra hit, but normally it's one hit kills. Right. That'll be cool here. get some really powerful weapons in the later half of the game. Whoa. Well, you do have to survive long enough to get it. It's not going when your eyes start itching when you're playing a shmup, either. And some weapons are just clearly better for certain love. Watch out. Deadly blood balls. You won't die. Now we have our first choice of paths, but I can actually go back and forth across them. I think this was the easier way first. It'll be interesting to see more modern attempts uh, at the Shmup genre. Hey, Elgardo. Now, if I can fill this up before we get to the boss, this weapon just pretty much breaks the fight. No. <laughs> it's not good when your nose is itching either when you're trying to play a Shmup. Now I just remembered, I don't have a shield right now. <laughs> oh, that's not a shield. There you go. Now we're back. at full level. Ah, I'm not gonna get it. Yeah, I played the Curse of Izios the other night too, Rob. Which is kind of like a uh, retro throwback to like Ninja Gaiden and those kinds of games. Or Castlevania, I should say. Yeah. So this is why this weapon just breaks this level, or breaks this fight. Because I ain't just completely cover the whole arena. I'm not doing as much damage as I would normally, but I basically don't have to worry about any real threats. There you go, you're dead. And we get one of my favorite sub-weapons, the Twin Bombs. Now the ceiling is no longer off for my attacks. Right, I'm gonna switch back to the rail gun since we now have the twin bomb. But 
I, oh god, I forgot about the damn jumping frog nuts. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Those things are gonna start coming at me fairly soon. There they go. Hey. Power up. Oh crap. Oh god. That was a little sketchy. So is that. Alright, I'm operating without a safety here. Alright, we're back. on the moons of Saturn. Oh yes, this fight. All we gotta do is just kick him out from the front. Crap. Screw up. I don't want to get multiple ones coming at me, though. Alright. I think it follows a pretty defined path, thankfully. Alright, almost done. Duh. Don't think that was the boss. Oh, it was. Something gonna be special over here. Yeah, the music's amazing on this. I'm gonna take the tur turry wall. Oh, I said it right. Because that's gonna be my emergency. Alright, that's a level two. And again, you can see just how useful it is. Oh! Shit. <laughs> to have the means of attacking around you? No. Nuts, I missed it. There, now I can be calm again. Again, when you're going for perfection, it's a different story taking damage. <laughs> Alright. That's fully level now. I have my emergency, which I may be needing for this fight. I think there may be still a part three. Oh boy. This is gonna be fun. And there's also secrets in every level. Which I'm not even close to finding. 
Uh, fully sized quick before they start launching their death bolts. Oh crap. I just remember this part. Bye, move. We're all good. We're all good. Oh crap, I didn't realize the Zan actually pushes you down. I'm remembering all the challenges I'm about to run into here. And again, never look the ability to shoot in mobile directions. Alright, that should be the first part. Now for the challenge. <laughs> time for some quiet time. Wish I had my shield right about now. So the scouts are basically a extra set of shots. Uh, I'm gonna keep the twin bombs. But I should be getting a weapon upgrade soon. I would like a shield though. Grab the wrong one. I think this means we're about to fight something special, if I remember right. I'm not sure who this guy is, but I think that's supposed to be our robot son. And we got through it. Not every level will end with a power-up. Eh, oh boy. Oh, boy. This will be some fun. Just wait till you see this one. I think I would like to get my special weapon back. That's right, shoot through walls. Crap. It's a good thing I don't swear a whole lot, because there's a there will be a whole lot of that coming very soon. And I'm not really a shmup guy to begin with, so keep that in mind. Okay. Too risky to go for that item. Alright, I think I'm out. Yeah, you're gonna hear a lot more amazing soundtracks as we get further in. Whoa. Alright, 
boss time. Oh yes, I remember this guy now. This is gonna take a few minutes, folks, just because I'm gonna try and do this on the safe side. Doesn't have a lot of health. But it is, as you can tell, a very tricky fight. Uh oh. I think that's the only boss that's like me, so... The other boss will be going by a lot faster. I bet you could get Brain right that third rent wrong in the middle. But I am sure that is very risky. I bet for speedrunners, they'll probably do that themselves. Oh boy. There we go, guy. Now there's one final challenge of this area. Kind of like a little mini puzzle. <laughs> all I have to do is blow up all the little notes. Get there's one you down there. Alright, big gold head. That's used to unlock a special weapon near the end of the game. Uh, I think for this one I'll switch to the Scort. Oh, you're gonna love the music for this level. Got killed there. Yeah, 
upgrading this will make my life a whole lot easier with the power boost. And the fact that they also hurt these things helps out as well. You know that things don't fall, right? Oh man. Oh yes, I remember this part now. And again, you get the right sub weapon. And it can trivialize a lot of these encounters. Like that. fleet in the open space. Our only chance is to destroy their war core, so find a way through the enemy lines and hit the target. And all those ships will not help us at all. I should probably upgrade my laser first. Hey. get my third turbo. Shoot it! As before, we want to try and take a little bit of damage to both of them at the same time. Careful. Alright, one's down. And of course, this guy's gonna get pissed off. There we go, but we got him. But that's not the end of this level. I kind of wish you could exchange your. Uh, sub weapons like at certain points. No. Oh god. Let's avoid that, shall we? I really want to get my laser upgraded now. When's the next death cloud coming? Looks like I can only hold three of those. I've never used them, so I didn't have, I didn't have a chance to see how much you get. Oh crap. I'll even be happy with level 2 laser.
those things can actually block that. I had no idea. It's good that you're always learning something new in a game like this. Probably don't want to be staying right in the middle here. Because that's coming. Alright. Our skirts are level 3 now. Now I can just get my main weapon out there. We'll be good to go. Some of the longer stages can be a little bit uh, dicey, I notice. engine order for this. So far, so good. It has been a great <laughs> victory, boys. But we don't have time to celebrate. Intelligence I've tried emailing a local multi about doing a live cast, and I don't think they've ever hardware. he's ever responded. They consider it a day. I did send them over the review and spotlight put up earlier, so maybe I'll 
follow up with that if they email me back. See if you can pay attention to where the secret item is on this level. Look at shield, please. Oh, that's not a shield. This is gonna be annoying. And that's why. I'm just gonna cheap it there. Pink Elephant, we're good now. We can beat the game now, folks. The Pink Elephant has been captured. For this one, you just gotta stay above the ice. I'm not the one who put it in. Yeah, we got a secret. This is the pain level. I actually want to come back to that one once I got a few more upgrades. For this one, if I remember right, um, Tail is going to be very useful for it. Tail. I wouldn't like to get my hands on a stealth power up. this. They are not respecting the left side of the screen on this level, are they? Oh boy. Alright, now for the annoying fight. This is why Tails required, because this part is ridiculously annoying without With it, it's not that bad. Mm. 
And again, notice the boss variety in the game, too. Every boss fight is completely different. No! Aw. Like God before he could shoot. Yeah, this can't go through. Oh. It's very nicely, I turn my ship around in these parts. Alright. Are you dead yet? And he's got one more core. Achievement for hitting first sergeant. to the upper left is the one I'm dreading, because that's where I lost the majority of my lives. I would like to get a weapon upgrade. Or at least upgrade the mines, or my bounciness to its max. There we go. No bouncing power. The only problem is that it's messing with my vision here. Because I keep seeing those bullets and I think they're enemy bullets. Can't hit 
those missiles, Sally. See, it's bouncy time. This, I think, is the hardest level in the game. And if, it is, if there's any place that's going to cause me to credit, it's going to be this one. Those things will track me, and then they'll get super fast once I get close. things will shoot out spikes if I shoot them. So now I gotta watch where I'm actually shooting my weapon here. You know, because this wasn't bad enough. And I know you're thinking, surely that was the hard part, right? No, it's not. Now we have the fun part. You didn't think we have to go through this without avoiding the water, right? Now we have flying fish. This is not a game you can really talk to and play. Now I can get behind those. They also explode. I 
like to get my hands. Both of those things. Not bad. This is definitely my best run by far for this level. Of course, having said that, I will now die. This is the exact reason why I took those twin bombs. <sighs> but we're not done yet. Did you really think we were done that soon? No. Nope, we're not done yet. What the hell was that? please. And this is the other reason why I need the twin bombs. We actually have vocals now. Because I had to kill that thing before we get down there or I lose. I will probably be using my stealth I'm fine with uh, using... I'd rather preserve the shield here. <sighs> but we're not done yet. Oh boy. Did I screw this up? Oh my god. I was not expecting to get through that without getting hit. That was, I think in my opinion, the hardest stage of the game. So I'm feeling really happy with myself that I managed to do that. This is where my minds are going to be very good today. Oh crap. When I first did this age, I didn't have the mind power up equipped, too. And as you can see, they are helping out quite nicely. Oh crap. I 
real idiot. I just realized I can shoot through these things and hit the hives. Alright, Rob, have a good night. As in, the better my rank, the harder it becomes. But as I said earlier, get yourself the right weapon, and it makes life a lot easier for you in this game. Now, there are some weapons that are just flat-out superior, but we won't be getting those until near the end. Yes, the scored four. We're actually almost done the game, too. As I said in my review, the only, I think, major downside is that it is a bit on the short side. I would like to get at least one stealth. Also, keep your eyes out for secrets, because I know I've missed them on... I believe he said there's a secret on every level. Alright, pick it up yet. I was sure I was gonna get hit there. Let's just say it's a good thing I'm not a man who curses a lot. Because I think I would be screaming a few expletives playing this game. Yeah. a very tricky part at the end of the stage. Uh-oh. Now I remember this guy. See, he's gonna try and grab me, so I have to push him from one side to the other for safety. All while dealing with his little friends. The wave is not the strongest weapon, unfortunately. But being able to shoot through solid objects is a really nice help here. Oh crap. That wasn't the challenging part either. Again, really amazing music. Hey, Alberto, do, does uh, Loco Multio sell their soundtracks? Alright, 
got a stealth. I think it will activate it here. Oh, I blew it. This is gonna be the annoying part. I really need a shield right about now. And what's really nice, I can use my mines not only to hurt these guys, but to also give me vision. And as you can see, as with any schmup, I thought I was going to get hit there. Being able to keep your upgrades goes a long way towards making it easy. This is the part that gets very crazy, and you'll see why in the next second. I can't hurt these things either, so it's quiet time, folks. <laughs> Stealth. I also want to tell you folks, when I first played through this, I thought I had to keep the special light on for every mission, so I didn't have stealth doing that section, I did that all by myself. You only need to use the light in one level. So I basically made the game about 10 times harder for myself the first time I played uh, Super Hydra. Because apparently I like the pain. We almost got the really good weapon, but homing is where it's at. Once I get those bad boys fully upgraded, we're gonna have some fun. What hit me? I didn't even see what hit me there. Oh yeah, they s stole my boots. I did not realize how useful Wave really was. Yeah, crap. achievement. Alright, so down here, this is where I need light. Left. 
And if I didn't say it at the beginning, I'll say it again. Spoiler alert. Oh, so the uh, Hydra, the the free version, uh, free download on Bandcamp. So the light is only used on this one level. There's also an extra life here. I don't know if I'm crazy enough to go for it. Done yet. Turbo's gonna hurt. That I now have access to the ultimate sub weapon. Not only does it do damage, but it also makes me invulnerable for a second. If I remember right, those things go crazy. After they're destroyed. Like that. Basically, we're going to kill them, we want to kill them quickly. And if not, we just want to leave them alone. Dumb luck, my friend. having a boost right now 
really is hurting me. Now we got the ultimate weapon. Princess Madeline, that's the female... Oh, cool. Oh, crap. Ancient sword. We are fighting the enemy fleet in sectors. Just remembered this part. Unit 87, now it's your turn to enter Meropticon and destroy Hydra. I love that. I'm gonna shoot him up pile. What's the skull in the background? Power. Power. Guess what, folks? We have seven bosses I have to kill now. Oh, I'm sorry, not seven. Six. Good news is I don't have to kill them all at the same time. If I die, it'll actually just save my spot. Which is really good on him for doing that. There's my sword. Oh crap, I just remember this part. I'll be honest with you, I'm not sure how I was able to dodge that. Way there. Thing is, I've been most of the annoying bosses. <sighs> Son of a, you know what. <laughs> Alright, that's five. One left. I am going to die here. I can feel it in my bones. Son of a... Oh my god. I don't know how I just dodged that one. There's 
in, there's two. And then we'll screw up, we should be good. And that was not bad for this fight. One life loss. Oh crap. This is gonna suck. very much. What the hell? Now the lasers. This on my first try the last time I play this. hitting each other. Thread some needles. Oh, I screwed up. wasn't the final fight either. Good. Thank 
get my get all my power back. We can do this. I would be saying far worse than that if I lose the perfect ending at this point. Everyone better get ready to cover your ears. It's quiet time now. Oh no, wait, we got one more. There's only one more challenge left before the finale. I love you, homing missiles. I love you so very much. Never leave me.
I can get a few more swords. Oh wait, don't fire anymore here. We'll be good. Yeah, that's right, we're in another hell section. If I ever talk to a local Multio, I need to ask him why every game ends in hell. <laughs> Alright, boys and girls, it is quiet time. Power. If we do this, I may be one of the first people to have perfected Super Hydra and have it recorded. All right, no pressure, right? Hydra, your turn is come to an end. You are in war with every planet under this sun. I'm still call me tyrant! That was some badass music. Now you must die. Of course I must. His damn pinching hands are trying to shield him. Where did that wave actually Oh crap, it works as a defense here. That's game. And that is game, boys and girls. Oh my god, I put the controller down for a second there. Oh, we. I almost got hit by that last shot there, too. <laughs> I would have really cursed at that point. <laughs> Alright, putting the controller down. Nothing else attack me, please. <laughs> Average. <laughs> Oh boy. So apparently this robot I think is our son according to the backstory. But that my friends is game. I 
thank you, Elgardo. I was having the current world record for this game at least for a couple of hours. It feels good. Could someone make me a little metal? Alright, I'll shut up. <laughs> Grizzler is amazing with this, with these sounds and the music. Commander gets a guitar. I get a clicker achievement. Ready for bed, I think. Oh, this is new. What's uh, going on here? And there is a special two-player co-op mode, too. Oh. Ah. Our type Oh, we're going through the history of shmups here. I don't recognize this one coming up. I'm sure the shmup fans in the audience are recognizing these ships. Where's Axelite? the hero ending. And that is Grandmaster for right now. Thanks, Captain Average. Thank you, Thorn. Way, way to gut punch me for my victory. <laughs> 